Hello guys, it's me we Wen, and welcome to another BTS Texts video, Things Get Furry. BTS Texts number 116. Hoseok grew a fur. Juni. Skull Tay for putting a dog's shampoo on my body wash bottle. Gross, Tay, why do you do that? Do you know how much shampoo and body wash are? I'm not defending Tay but, Tani shampoo smells good. And you can rush out, no. The flavor of the shampoo he put in my bottle is durian. For King Durian, I already reshowered two times. I can still smell its pungent smell. It is strong, young. It's chimps dare. And I thought the smell will vanish after one wash. Don't say like you weren't excited to do that dare. You even thanked me for it. I'm afraid I'll go bald if I wash my hair many times until the smell goes away. Hoo hoo, if I went bald, I swear Tay, I will shave your head using durian spiky skin. My only concern is, who in their right minds would make a shampoo out of durian? My concern is, what if Young will turn into a dog cause he used a dog's shampoo? Cookie, stop the nonsense. Or what I mean is, stop imagining childish things. More moments later. <coughs> what the fork is that noise? Why can't I sleep peacefully in this house? Why, South Korea should make a law where screams aren't allowed at mornings. Agree. What is happening on my body? I just, grew a hair. No. A fur all over my body. <coughs> I knew it. You just turned into a dog cause of the shampoo. Oh my gosh. I just went in his room and yes, he grew a fur. He looks like a chimpanzee. Don't go into details. I'm very emotional right now. Please leave me alone. How did it happen? What I know is the shampoo can only grow dog's hair faster. It didn't say it'll work on humans young. I am very sorry it happened to you. Maybe you're expecting this. You bought it so I can suffer from having longer furs. No, I didn't. I only found out it's for that purpose when you already used it. You're partly to blame. Hobby. Cause you didn't smell it before putting it on your skin. Yungi. I smelled expensive before I take a bath. It overpowered the shampoo, so what are we gonna do? We have a meeting in HYBE later. You won't come, I have a suggestion. We can wax his whole body. Maybe it won't grow again, no. What if it'll grow again but this time thicker? Like beards and mustache, we should eliminate the hair follicles. But if we do, you won't grow hair? Ever, I'm sure he won't mind living with no hair at all. Right, hobby? No prob. Maybe there's a shampoo that can bring back how my body hairs are used to. I'll ask my dermatologist friends about this. Your hair will go back, I promise. I'll go to the nearest pet store where I bought the shampoo. Maybe he can help us. No. I mean, don't go there Tay. I don't trust the pet shop. Let's give it to Junie. Duh. Maybe the pet shop have the shampoo that you are looking for. More options. Bigger chance your body hair will go back to its original length. I said what I said. I don't trust the pet shop so don't you dare ask for their help. Later. Hobby. I think it will last longer than I thought. My friends don't know that case yet. See? I told you. We should now ask the pet shop if they can help you. It's for you. No way. There's still a solution but the pet shop. I really don't trust them. What's wrong with you? We won't lose anything if we ask if they can help you. Know what? We'll go there even if you don't want us to. You can't go out anyway. Don't you dare do that. Respect your furry friend's decision. Don't go there. Too late. Me and Tay just did. And we found out why you don't want us to go there. Yeah right. We went there. Secretly. To tell what happened. Fork you. Young. So what did you find out? And why it seems like Hobby made a sin? Tell me, his fur is fake. The owner told us he asked for all the dog's fur they'd groomed. He doesn't want us to go there so that we won't find out the truth. He fooled us, is that true, Hobby? All those fur I saw, you just glued that to your body, fine. I did that to get my revenge. I can still smell the durian, you know. If I were in Hobby's shoes, I'd do the same. Or I'd get my revenge more than that. Why do I feel like you thought of that cause of what I said? The turn into a dog thingy. That is right. I got it from you. You are the brains of my revenge. 
So thanks, good thing we decided to go at the pet store cause we really feel bad of what we did. Enough talking about fur. Unless you have a thing with furs. Ra. Woof woof. Um, I have a problem. I can't remove the fur I glued on my skin. It's super sticky. I tried pulling some of the fur. I removed it but with some skin. Now I'm bleeding. I just found out the glue I bought is a gorilla glue. Help me. I'm begging you. Oh my gosh. Don't pull another hair, okay? We need to bring you in the hospital. Maybe the reason you didn't bother to read the label is you have expensive smell. Stop teasing me. It won't help me take the fur off of my skin. Hu hu hu. Werewolf at the neighborhood. I have breaking news. Our new neighbor, he's not human. He's werewolf, Jin. Where did you get that? Werewolves aren't real. And stop spreading fake news. I've noticed lately that you're going out just to gossip. It'll get you in trouble. It's true. Ms. Kang confirmed. She heard the new bee howl in the middle of the night. And his name is Grey Wolf. Grey Wolf. Do you know what that forking means? If his name is Grey Wolf. That means he's from the west. From US. Maybe. Dump fork. He's trying to say he is a werewolf based on his name. But he's not. He is. Believe me. I just didn't hear his howl but I can feel it. I'll prove it to you. Later evening is full moon, that means he'll transform fully into a werewolf. Young, if he is a werewolf, isn't it better that you stay away from him? Yeah right. Or he should leave it to werewolf slayer. If that's even a thing. Guys, I can see his room from my room. I just need camera and binoculars. A few minutes later. I don't know but I'm being nervous too. Mr. Wolf has just arrived in his home. Based on his outfit, I can say that he's a manager. And he doesn't look like a wolf. He's a manager. Yes. But why did he go home this early? Cause the sun's still up. Jin. It's already past 5. Working hours usually end 5 in the afternoon. Jin needs to wake up. If you need someone to shake his head, I volunteer. Save your violence in fighting the wolf in case he caught me and tried to eat me. I think you need garlics. I heard it's the best weapon to kill a werewolf. Dumb fork. That's for vampires. You need to kill the moon to defeat the werewolf. Silver is the answer. That's why I borrowed all your jewelries made of silver. Borrowed is different than taking it by force. For fork's sake. Werewolf ain't real. I think we need to talk to Ms. Kang for feeding him fake news. She started it. She is a respected feeder of gossips. I heard dispatch has an offer for her. Anyways. Shush. I see him removing chains in his car's compartment. Oh no. Maybe he'll chain himself so he can't hurt people when he turned into a beast. I'm now packing my clothes and planning to leave this house until he gets sane. Stop spying on him. He can sue you. Maybe he'll use the chains for his dog. For dogs. That chains are fatter than Tanny's legs. That is for bigger than dog. He took out a sweater on the back seat. I'm sure it's made of sheep's wool. Beach. Have you never seen a sweater made of sheep's wool before? My gosh, what he meant is the idiom. Wolf in sheep's clothing. Am I right? If he wears that sweater, does it make him a sheep? Or a wolf cosplaying sheep? You're making my last three brain cells scream in agony. Chim. I thought you're leaving. The meaning of it is, a bad person pretending to be good. A fraud. The fork you guys saying? I was surprised cause that's the sweater I wanted to buy. Later. Jin. It's 12 a.m. You should be sleeping right now. He won't turn into a beast. Yeah right. The moon's up. And no werewolf showed in this village. Cause he chained himself. Plus, he put curtains so no one can see him from outside. As all people should. You need it so you can have privacy. Especially at night. I peeked outside. And do I see it right? There's cops heading to our house. Can we talk to Kim Sokjin? And did I hear it right? They just called my name? What for? What did I do? Maybe Wolf saw you spying on him so he called cops. This is what I signed up for. Young looks so scared while talking to the cops. I think Yungi Young is right. Guys. Yungi is right. And the cops want me to take to their office for questioning. You are now an adult man. You can make it yourself. We believe in you. Ah, uh, Mr. Wolf's house is now lit up. He is outside. And he's still human. So he ain't a beast. I still doubt it. 
Maybe he drank a potion to stop him from turning into a beast. You still have the courage to talk like that about him while you're with the cops. The cop's car already left. Yet Mr. Wolf is still outside. Looking at the moon. See? Weird right? I hope I can record that so I can show it to Miss Kang. What's weirder is we are all now in the same room, peeking at Mr. Wolf. Whoa. Did my eyes just trick me or a lady just jumped in front of him from the sky? What? A woman just showed up from the sky? Maybe she's his wolf friend too. No. Mr. Wolf screamed when he saw her. And the woman took him away. You won't believe this. That woman is Ms. Kang. She's the wolf. Not Mr. Wolf. What? She just texted me, asking why we're screaming. I said I'm with the cops. She also said that Mr. Wolf is in our porch. Holding many cell phones. Smiling. Guys, what's happening? Why can't I contact you? Can't contact Miss Kang too. So I was right that Miss Kang discovered my secret. You're next, Jim. You're next. The end.